Hey there, my name is Lexi and thank you so much for joining me for this Harmony Breakdown. Today I'm doing the Harmony Breakdown for the song Check by the UK girl group called Flow. I gotta say before we get into this, huge respect to these ladies. I talk about it in the studio session video that may have posted before this or maybe it posted after. I don't know yet. But I respect these ladies so much because it's been a long time since I've been excited about some new music and um, I also got to experience their live performance and they put on a damn good show. So I became a fan when I saw them open up for Kehlani when they came to Atlanta at the amphitheater. I think at Lakewood Amphitheater, I think. But um, I became a fan instantly. I had never really listened to their music before, but I love the sound. The mics were on and it's a three girl group. Like we haven't seen that in a very long time and they're actually good and the music is actually good and their stage presence is good and they're just total package from what I say. So all of that to say that I decided to do a harmony breakdown for their song Check because it's a lot of great three part harmonies going on in there and I think it's a, it's a great song to study, you know, like some of the newer releases that have come out. So if that sounds interesting to you, then please continue to stay tuned. Welcome to anyone who is new to my channel. My name is Lexi and welcome back to anybody who is returning. I've got a few things for you here, all right? If you haven't seen my other Harmony Breakdown videos, then make sure you go check that out. The last Harmony Breakdown video I did was Girl Talk by TLC. So if you want to see that, then you can uh, click. I think the information bubble comes on this side. I guess we'll find out after this is edited and posted. <laughs> but make sure you go check that out. And uh, also check out at some point whenever I decide to post it, the studio session for this, as well as like just the acapella and the cover. There's going to be a few pieces of content surrounding this song. So y'all just be on the lookout for that. Alrighty. Before we get into this harmony breakdown, I want to tell you about a very special product that is actually going to help me to get through the rest of the day. And I'm talking about Magic Mind. Magic Mind is a mental performance elixir with a bunch of great organic ingredients. And that is the Magic Mind promise to always give good natural organic ingredients that are ingredients that are responsibly resourced. There's great stuff like turmeric, ashwagandha, there's L-theanine, I can't talk today, lion's mane, mushroom, bacopa monieri, ashwagandha, vitamins B2, B3, B12, C, and D. Just a whole bunch of great stuff. It's a little concoction. This is for mental performance, for less stress, for better energy, ooh, and for vitality. And I like to keep mine chilled. Um, you know, before I try things, I like to get reviews to see what other people are thinking. And I've, I've, I've looked at other people's reviews and they said, wow, I really noticed a difference in my energy or I really noticed a shift in my mood. And I gotta say that since I started doing Magic Mind, since I started drinking it, I experienced the exact same things. It keeps me focused and it keeps me energized, which is very important because I can tend to like trail off and be very tired, very sleepy girl because my line of work, working in recording studios, I'm always working at random hours throughout the day. I'm at the mercy of other people's schedules. And sometimes that just doesn't agree with the schedule of my body. So I take Magic Mind and it really helps me. I keep mine chilled in the fridge. And I actually did a test. This really is a shot. Anywho, at the risk of rambling, I want you to try it too because it is delicious and it really does work. You can go to magicmind.com slash Lexi20 for 20% off of your order. That's magicmind.com. Mm, it's satiable, satiating in my mouth. That's magicmind.com slash Lexi20 for 20% off of your order of Magic Mind. Try it, experience a sharper mind, lower stress, better energy. All of those things I have experienced and I can vouch for. And you can get 20% off, again, magicmind.com slash Lexi20. Alrighty? Now let's get into this harmony breakdown of the song Check by the UK girl group Flow. And you know, I didn't know they were from the UK until they started speaking on stage. And I was like, yo, y'all ain't even from the United States. That's crazy. But all right, this is going to be broken down into two parts. All right, we've got the verse and we've got the hook. The song starts with the verse. So we're going to start with that. Obviously, there are seven parts, okay? There's the lead and then there are three harmonies, but depending on how you choose to do it, 
there's either going to be four parts or seven parts. So there's a lead, high, mid, low. The reason why I'm saying it could be seven, depending on how you do it, how many people you have or, you know, whatever, whatever, um, is because I do have high harmony, mid harmony and low harmony. But I have a high one, a high two, a mid one, a mid two, a low one, a low two. And then that that lead is on top of there. Right. And the reason why that is, is because there is some overlapping with the harmonies. In the way that I recorded it, I put I did the cover song on Pro Tools and that's the way that I recorded it. If you want to get around having all of those parts, you can condense some of the parts. And I will I will hopefully remember to explain that when we get to the hook, because that's when it happens. That's when those overlaps happen. Um, but otherwise, yeah, this is how the breakdown is going to go. Been looking far and wide to find the kind of guy who satisfies I finally think I found him now Cause with the guys I've dated probably should be jaded Feels like I've been waiting for him all my life He's taking me to cloud nine I'm at a fast Yeah, I know the best is him So all my friends ask me is he loyal Check See, spoil. Check. Does he clear that? Check. Before you met him, did you do your background? Check. Is he faithful? Check. Gentleman. man. Check. The way I trust him, I ain't gotta check. Ah. Cause he gave it so good. Cause he gave it so good, no doubt. Ah. Cause he gave it so good. Cause he gave it so good, no doubt. So let's get into the first verse very much straightforward following exactly what Flo did when they just just follow the leads just follow the leads <laughs> been looking far and wide to find a kind of guy who satisfies i finally think i found him now because with the guys i've dated probably should be jaded feels like i've been waiting for him all my life so the leads are very straightforward just follow exactly what those ladies are doing and you know i actually don't know their names but just follow exactly what the lead is doing i will caution you to control your breathing because there are there are spaces for you to take a breath while doing this but it does sound like very much a straight through flow right so there's like a uh uh if i were singing this would be the motion that i would use for this been looking far and wide to find a guy who wait been looking far and wide to find a kind of guy who satisfies i finally think i found him now so there are opportunities in there for you to breathe just make sure you're being very mindful very demure about where that is okay been looking far and why to find a kind of guy so just before that last word that's where an opportunity is to breathe been looking far and why to find a kind of guy who satisfies i finally think i found him now got it good and as always you can always rewind these back if you need to practice the parts if you need to listen to what it is i'm saying and get a better understanding of what is what is lexi talking about so that is the first verse all right now let's get into the harmonies for the first verse there are three harmonies in the first verse okay let's start with i'll give you the high all righty now the high there's like little high lights um kind of like in and out highlights for the high harmony this is harmony part high harmony part one right so there are highlights on this and then there is some like ooh ah type of stuff so let's listen to what that sounds like so you can see what i'm talking about been looking for it to find a kind of who satisfies i cause with the guys i probably should be feels like i've been high okay so that is the high harmony for the verse and again it is that same so it's very much 
the first half of the phrasing, if I could try to explain it in that way, first half of the phrasing, it adds just a little sprinkle. And I was listening in headphones that I don't quite love the sound of, to be quite transparent. But um, I'm pretty sure that's what they're doing. If not, then that's what I hear. But that is the harmony that I'm using there, okay? And uh, pretty straightforward. Do practice, do practice, and memorize where you're coming in. With these kinds of harmonies, you very much have to be in tune with whoever is singing the lead and make sure that you're in the same time because it's sung in unison. They're just different pitches. You know what I'm saying when I say that? So you're saying the same words at the same time, just in different keys, different pitches. Now let's go on to what the mid harmony sounds like on this part. So this is going to be the pre-hook. I guess I should have um, more clearly explained that. We're going verse and pre-hook for this first part, technically the pre-hook, and then we're going to go into the hook. So this is part of the pre-hook. This is what the mid sound like. I, nine, that's still, yeah, this him. So with these mid harmonies, it's not singing in unison like most of the high notes are doing, right? So again, really got to pay attention to where you're coming in between because it's filling in, it's, it's singing in unison and giving harmony to some things, but it's not exactly saying the same words as what the lead is doing, right? It's more ooh, ah, and then it has certain feelings like nine, yeah, you know? So just practice, 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 practice. But that is what's going on with the mid harmonies in the pre-hook. And now the last, the last harmony that's going on in the pre-hook again is the low harmony. Let's hear what that sounds like. I best it is him. Okay, so with the low harmonies, kind of the same thing going on with the mid, except you don't have those filler words. So you've got that first one that's like, I. it's like an in-between harmony and but then after that you're singing in unison with the different pitch so singing at the same time singing the same words but in a lower register that is what's going on with the low harmonies in the pre-hook so now that is everything for the verse of the song or if you want to get technical in my head the verse and the pre-hook now let's go into what the harmonies are and what the parts are for the hook. So starting with our lead vocals, this is what it sounds like. Very straightforward. Let's give it a listen. So all my friends ask me, is he loyal? He spoil. Does he clear that? Before you met him, did you do your background? Is he faithful? Gentleman. The way I trust him, I ain't got to check. Cause he gave it so good, cause he gave it so good, no doubt. Cause he gave it so good, cause he gave it so good, no doubt. Okay, so with the leads going on in the hook right here, very straightforward. There's definitely more of an opportunity to breathe. There are more breaks in the lines, in the lyrics on this part of the song. Um, I do want to caution you that very last line at the end you do have to flip into a falsetto. So again, that's one of those things where it's just adding a little bit of embellishment, a little bit of like a very tiny run, you know, very tiny, but it, it makes it more interesting. And so just make sure that you're paying attention to how you are making your voice flip. I think it's so good right now. Why do I keep saying right now? It's no doubt. Cause it gave it so good, no doubt. Cause it gave it so good. Cause it gave it so good, no doubt. So for me, I just insert a lot of air. Give it so good, no doubt. A lot of air and I'm kind of pushing it forward to get that falsetto tone out. So the lead, that's where it gets a little tricky right there. Um, and flipping in and out of a head voice and um, a head voice and what you call it, I guess a chest voice. Flipping in and out of that is something that 
oftentimes does need to be practiced if you're not as experienced of a singer. But again, like I said, like who's who's going to know? Who's watching? You have plenty of time to practice. You can always rewind if you need to, to listen, repeat after me, listen, repeat after me, and just repetition, repetition. If you do end up watching the studio session for this video, which is somewhere on this channel, um, then you'll see that I do a lot of takes when I'm doing these covers. So, you know, if this is something you're going to have to do live, you need to repetition, repetition until it's like ingrained. So just keep that in mind. So without further ado, now remember, still a three-part harmony. This is where I say you can either break this into three parts or you can have, well, I guess six total. Yeah. This is where the song can either be four parts or it'll be seven parts. So this is three-part harmony, but I have high one, high two, mid one, mid two, low one, low two. You can consolidate if you want to, um, but I'm just going to give you, let me give you the first high. Check. 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 Okay, so that is what the first high sounds like, alrighty? And now I want to play the second high for you and let you hear what that sounds like. So that's what, here's what it is. Cause it gave us some good, cause it gave us some good, no doubt. Cause it gave us some good. So as you can see, there are some parts that are like fillers, those in betweens, kind of like an ad lib. Da 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 da, check da 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 da, check da 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 da, check. So if I were to consolidate this to make this like, let's say you're a group and there's like four of y'all. You got somebody doing a lead and you got, you each got those three girls, got a harmony. If I wanted to consolidate this because I don't have enough people, then I would have those checks. I would have the person sing that check and then, I get so good, no doubt. I, you know, something like that. But you really just, just got to play with it, honestly. But if I wanted to consolidate, I would try to do a mixture. I would mostly keep that. Ah, but it really just depends on what you do. The, the answer here is it depends. There's no right or wrong answer. It's just what do you want to do and how do you want to accomplish it? Okay. So now the mid harmonies for the hook. Let's hear mid one and what that sounds like. Jack. Jack, 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 Jack. Ah, that is the first mid harmony. Now let me play the second mid harmony for you so you can hear what is doing what. Cause it gave it so good. Cause it gave it so good. Cause it gave it so good, no doubt. You've heard the first high, the second high, same thing, the first mid, the second mid. If I was to consolidate this, I would recommend you have that one person doing the mid note Check, check, check. Ah, yeah, it's so good. Ah, yeah, it's so good, no doubt. Just be very careful to make sure that you're breathing in the right places. Since we are consolidating, you don't want to run the risk of running out of air. If you run out of air, then you're less likely to hit the notes properly. So you just want to be mindful of those things. And I, internet is so crazy because anytime I say mindful now, I just want to automatically say very demure. But we don't need to say all that. We don't need to say that every time. We don't need to. Alrighty. So 
Last but not least, we have our low notes. And again, I got I got two for you. So let's hear low number one and how that sounds. It's really just gonna be the, uh, but let's hear how that sounds. Uh, That is low one. Now, let me play low two for you. Here's what that sounds like. Cause he gave it so good. Cause he gave it so good, no doubt. Cause he gave it so good. Cause he gave it so good, no doubt. Low one, low two. If you have the people, I would have them sing those separately because it does overlap. But if you had to consolidate it, Ah, give it so good, no doubt. Ah, give it so good, no doubt. And did I sing that right, or did I just make up a note? Give it so good, no doubt. Yeah, I made it up. Give it so good, no doubt. All right, so go back and listen to what I officially did. But that's how I would consolidate those two things. All righty. If you're trying to do this as a live situation and you're assigning harmonies, then that's how I would do it, right? And I would say to do this with four people, you could get away with it with with three, right? Uh, it's just, no, I would say do it with four people. Yeah, just because the way that I decided to do this, of course there is a way, like you could have your lead person take on the mid harmonies is, is that's what I would typically do. And then the two other girls, one take a high, one take a low. So whoever's doing the lead note, you would take on the mid harmonies when it comes to this part. The only thing you gotta be mindful of is when you're doing the check part. So if you only have like three people, right? And this is, if you got three or four people, this is what I'm explaining. If you've only got three people, whoever is doing the lead, you're gonna do that. Is he loyal? Check. Is he spoiled? Check. And then you're gonna have your your high person and your low person do that. Check. Check. Do the mid check and the high check. All right. And then the lead person. If you only have three people, the lead person will take on that mid harmony, and the high and the low harmony person fall in line with what was already explained. And then y'all consolidate in the way that I already explained it. Okay. So I hope that you enjoyed this harmony breakdown. I hope it made sense. If some parts didn't make sense to you, or if you still have some questions, then just comment down below. Um, and I will be in the comment section and try to explain some things for you. Or I might even have to do another video, depending on what you're asking and if I feel like I can explain it through text or if I have to show you, right? So yeah, just comment down below if there's anything you don't understand. Otherwise, I hope that you enjoyed this harmony breakdown and uh, I share in the fandom for these ladies, you know, I, I respect them so much. Their show was so amazing. They opened for Kehlani and when I tell you them and Kehlani, that was the perfect ticket, the perfect show, man, what? So um, yeah, very excited for Flo, um, excited for them to gain more traction in the States. I'm sure they're doing amazing in the UK because that's where they're from. But uh, yeah, this was really a fun song to do. And listening to the lyrics, like it's a positive song, which is what my soul has been being starved of with the mainstream stuff, other than my own music, right? But my, my spirit has been starved of this in typical mainstream stuff. And it's so interesting that they happen to be from the UK and being able to sing these messages. But that's a conspiracy video for a whole nother day. Uh, before I ramble too much, yeah, like, share, subscribe. Um, what is another song that you would like me to do a harmony breakdown for? Leave that in the comment section down below. And before you get out of here, I want to give a final shout out to Magic Mind. You can go to magicmind.com slash Lexi20 to get 20% off of your order of Magic Mind. And uh, yeah, make sure y'all do that. I think that's all I got for you in this one. I think I went through all of my points. Yes? Yes. Well, again, my name is Lexi. Thank you so much for tuning in. Until next time, peace. All my friends ask me